delicious and lose weight with Chef Pachi. Hi, this is Chef Pachi and today I have an amazing recipe for you. We are going to create passion fruit shrimp over patacones. It is beautiful and super easy to make. First thing we're going to do is we're going to create our salad. And our salad is the Chef Pachi's favorite salad because it's one that helps you not gain weight if you eat the same amount of carb that you eat. And it is so easy to make. All we have to do is grate our cabbage. We added three cups of cabbage, add the lime juice, a tablespoon of lime juice, and two tablespoons of cilantro. Then you can drizzle a little bit of olive oil. I normally add dark sesame oil, but now I'm not gonna use dark sesame oil, but olive oil, because I don't want to have it stronger than the flavor of my shrimp. Refrigerate it and keep it there for just when we're ready to serve. You can also keep it in the fridge for up to three days. Now we're going to create our plantain hearts. First thing we do is we peel our plantains. Then, after we peel our plantains, we cut them into two inch chunks. We take these chunks and we fry them on an oil that is not very hot for seven minutes. Then we and flatten them. At this point, you can refrigerate them or freeze them. Your patacones, they are already cold. It's easier to cut them when they are cold. That's how I began today. Okay. The second time we fry them is once we've had our hearts. We place some fresh oil on a pan. We add our patacones. Pan reaches 375 degrees Fahrenheit. Add a little bit of plantain. If it splatters too much, the oil is too hot. And if it doesn't bubble a lot, then it's too cold. Give it some more time. Cook each one of your patacones for two to three minutes until they are lightly golden and crisp. Place them over paper towels so that you can get rid of all the excess oil. Buy a passion fruit, it doesn't need to look round and perfect because it's actually better tasting when it's all shrunken like this. Cut it in half, take a spoon, and peel all of those seeds from the inside. That's where the flavor is. Each of the seeds around each other has all of the passion fruit pulp. Mmm, my mouth waters. This is the pure passion fruit pulp. It's delicious, it's very, very strong and acidic. So just a little bit gives a lot of flavor. Now we're gonna add a tablespoon of craisins. Then we're gonna add another tablespoon of basil leaves. Delicious, this mixture is amazing. A teaspoon of honey. teaspoon of garlic quarter teaspoon of turmeric then we're gonna add a quarter cup of almond milk this is gonna make a delicious sauce then you just blend these in a power blender or wherever you want or you can just mince them if you don't want to blend them and you're ready to go Let's go for our shrimp now. Now we have our sauce that we're gonna blend and have ready in a second. Last but not least, we're gonna cook our shrimp. Remember, shrimp take one to two minutes to cook, and that's it. So 
So let's go now and prepare our shrimp. Here we have four beautiful shrimp. Just a tidbit of salt and pepper and they're going to go on a non-stick pan that I'm using today. A little bit of coconut oil. Then I place my shrimp over medium high heat. You see how they cook in seconds. It's amazing. It's like 45 seconds on each side because these are not that big. And they're done. I had one of those break into pieces and I still can use it. It doesn't matter. Check that out. A minute on each side and we turn them. They're ready to go. It's so fast that that's why we leave them for last. We turn them and we're gonna add now a little bit of that sauce so that the second side of the shrimp cook with some of that delicious aromatic sauce with the passion fruit. Ooh, look at it boiling up. It's amazing, delicious. Cover them for just one minute and you see, in two minutes, you have your most amazing dish and it's very easy. You can serve this over pasta. You can serve this over black rice. How about that? Black rice with delicious shrimp. This can be an appetizer and also it can be a delicious dish if you have guests. So now we have our heart-shaped plantains and we have a red cabbage salad on the left side going to place our shrimp on top of the plantain and we're going to pour the sauce on top. This is a perfect, beautiful little meal and also it can be a delicious dish if you have guests. This can be an appetizer or you can even serve them at room temperature. This was a Valentine's Day breakfast for my husband who can eat at any time. Remember, with Chef Pachi, delicious diets, sustainable diets. Scroll down for the recipe. You can print it. Subscribe and turn on the bell for recipe updates.